Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Dots Homestyle Pretzels. These are the Southwest version. These were sent to us from John in Wisconsin. John said he found them at Pick and Save, which is Kroger owned. Uh, no, but, he, I know that. but he also, yeah, he so he sees a lot of things at Pick and Save Kroger that are Kroger brand. brand. Interesting. Um, yeah. Uh, so, but he said he also saw these at a Target uh, that's across the street. Um, he said that the regular price is $5.99. He got them on sale for $3.99. He said then he had a $2 reward coupon, so he only paid a dollar ninety-nine. So he got the an price that ten dollars ship it does. <laughs> he, he, yeah, he probably did. Yeah, Kevin's right. So thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, we appreciate that. So, I. Wow, that, uh, that is a strong, I, I'm looking forward to this. An unexpected start. Dot's Home Style Pretzels are a special family snack created many years ago by Dot in her home kitchen. We're a family owned business as well as a proud member of the Pride of Dakota brand. With bakeries located in North Dakota, or, or Arizona, and Kansas, we strive to grow our pretzel brand far enough so anyone who would like to enjoy them can. So, I smell jalapenos. Yes, it does smell like jalapeno. Um, a lot of you had uh, sent me comments and told me to look for these in Kroger. They do have the Dots Homestyle Pretzels in Kroger, not the Southwest. Mm -hmm. We looked everywhere. We looked at Meyer. We looked at Rural King because they sell the they Dots. Saw, yeah. uh, the, we have not seen the Southwest. Mm -hmm. So big ups to John for sending them to us. We appreciate it. Um, it's DotsPretzels.com. 16 servings are in the container, 28 grams. Let's weigh these. I'm gonna make Kevin get up. Uh, because they don't tell you um, a number of sticks. You have no idea how many sticks you get, so let's weigh them out and show you how many you get. 28 grams or 130, and I know you all always like a nice visual. Way too many. Ooh, almost. Oh my goodness, that's, that's almost, almost perfect. So, you don't get a ton. They're all broken. They're And they're all broken. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This has uh, tomato mm -hmm. powder, well, spices. 13 maybe. You may get 13 or so. 13 for 130. Uh, tomato powder, spices, cheddar cheese, well, I'll tell you what I smell. Red it's bell jalapeno. pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, um, jalapeno Pe pepper, paprika. Yeah, yeah you, and, and well, when I, I opened it, gosh, yeah. it smells incredible, but it's very strong. I wonder if John bought these for himself. Oh, he bought a bag for him. Mm-hmm. Because John does not like spicy things. He yeah. cannot tolerate spicy at all. And I wouldn't buy anything Southwest then. I was going to say, would you expect Southwest to be spicy? Like, mm -hmm. I mean, like hot, but these aren't. Or mine, mine was out. I think it heat to spice. Mm -hmm. Mm, those are good. I love the texture. Mm -hmm. What do you think about the jalapeno flavor? I love the flavor. Mm -hmm. I was going to say. I really, really love that flavor. I think if you didn't like hot food at all, you would feel that little tingle and probably wouldn't like it. There is a very, very slight tingle to yeah. me. Um, now, it's there. And I would say the more you eat, the more you're going to feel that. Or it goes away completely. And you, you but <laughs> I absolutely love that flavor. That would be the, that's the perfect combination of spices that would be excellent on a tortilla chip. Hmm. And I tell you where else I would like, I would like to taste that same spice flavor is on tacos. If they made corn, um, I like hard taco shells. If they made like a, a hard corn shell that had those spices, oh, I yeah. would love that. I don't, do they make spicy taco shells like that? Seasoned, like I think they seasoned did. taco I, shells? They did at one like a Doritos kind of 
That's why I don't, I don't think they that was, Not regularly. Because I, I love, they could sell that combination of spices in a packet. And mix it in with your hamburger. Yes, you, yes, that would be, that would probably be the easiest solution, mm -hmm. yeah. To, to mix that, the packet of those spices in with your hamburger and then put that on a taco. Or even nachos, or, because that is so delicious. Mm -hmm. I love the, the combination of spices there. So, we will enjoy these very, very much. Now, do you think Ashley will enjoy them? Because Ashley loves these pretzels. This she does, the, but I don't know that she likes the spice. The spice. I don't know. We'll have to get her to try them. She doesn't eat many uh, spicy foods, really. Mm -hmm. She's not. She doesn't eat Mexican food or anything like that. Um, so I don't know if she'll like that or not. But I'm, she is like their number one fan as far as the just the regular and they're good the regular um, ones are good yes too. we all like them so thank you so much to john for sending us these you'll have to comment below john and let us know if you bought a bag for yourself and if you did what you thought of them and because we really appreciate you sending them to us and thanks for watching